Welcome back to 5014 Africa, the channel that helps you travel Africa. I'm Nick from Namibia and in this video I'm showing you the Karma Rhino Sanctuary in Botswana. Just arrived, it's a 350 kilometer drive, northwest drive from Gaborone, 25 kilometers off this small little village of Seroe. The drive was good, um, the A1 dual carriageway up until about 50 kilometers off the Cabaron. From there it's a, it's a normal double lane road. Some potholes between Palapie and Seroe. Beware of the continuous jumps or decreases and increases in speed limits. It's, it's terrible and it slows you down a lot. A lot of animals on the road, beware of that. But now let me put up my tent and then we'll get, get the map out and we explore the park. I only have one day here, so I need to be quick. Tent is up, should be okay for tonight. Getting to the camp is pretty easy. I actually just, I sent them an email yesterday, pitched up and checked in at the gate. The reception at the gate is also a small shop, very, very basic. It's got some cold beers and toothpaste. That's, that's basically it. They also sell a map. From there, it's two and a half k's to the actual campsite. Pretty easy drive. And again, I just wanted to show you the view on this campsite. <laughs> this is bush, there's no fences, nothing. And the reason I came here is for Rhino. I'm not going to talk too much about the rhinos because there's evil people out there and they use these types of videos to locate rhinos. What I can tell you is there's a massive electric fence around this sanctuary. There's a big Botswana Defense Force base just down, just down the road and it's their responsibility to protect the rhinos here. The experiences I've had with the BDF, <laughs> they don't talk too much. <laughs> Good luck. Now we're searching for rhino. <laughs> As you can see, it's, it's pretty thick bush. They just love this. This is this is their natural <laughs> this is their natural habitat. Hopefully, we can find one or two or three. I just found the pan. I'm not sure if it's Malema's pan or Seroe pan, and this is what I found. pretty spectacular <laughs> I arrived I put up my tent I wanted to, when I wanted to go for a drive my map was missing and I said screw it I'm just gonna go for a drive and then I got here and I struggled to get the GoPro going and then when I wanted to take pictures there was no batteries in my camera I'm supposed to check these things every night and every morning regardless as soon as I stopped there I mean there was two giraffe playing in the felt and there's four rhinos at the water hole another another rhino can walking just past my car probably about 20 meters away from me so they end up being five another two giraffe joined some wartox joined some impala some zebra i mean this was the this was in my first hour being at gamma a rhino sanctuary that includes reception pitching my tent <laughs> No wonder uh, the sanctuary comes so highly recommended. I'm aware of the bonds that were created today. When you told me that sure there's a way. So how the sanctuary works is there's two separate bands, or old prehistoric bands, and they, they've created these flat plains. So on that side is the Malema pan and it's got a water hole. That's the first one we visited. And this is the second one, this is Sarawe Pan. And it's got a water hole in front as well because because there's so many rhino around, I don't want to go in between them, especially the 
because little mother will smoke all the time. The world is so still And my pain has gone away The air is much cleaner after it rains Follow my love I said it's in spring air Follow the moon into the sun There's a call for new beginnings here But the sorrow of yesterday disappeared I think I'll be heading back now so Let me just quickly show you the campsite the facilities, the ablutions And that's it, nothing more I can show you here This is as impressive as it gets and it's pretty, pretty impressive. I'm a wanderer of the soul. Before the end, I plan to be whole. But I know I'll lose myself along the way. What's gone is gone. What's past is past. Let me leave what belongs in the past. Before it gets dark, let's quickly check out the <laughs> Ablutions. Sink. Wash. Yeah, water. Light. Toilets. This is a shower. Shower and basin. It's okay, <laughs> considering we're in the bush. That's cool, that's my campsite. Campsite number six. Good little path that goes down to the campsite. And that's the facilities. I mean, you can't complain, you have all of this. Why would you complain? I just showed you 720 rhinos. <laughs> That's what I think this is for the video. I'm gonna drive down to my site, make a fire, relax, maybe start editing this video. Thank you for watching, I always appreciate it. Please consider subscribing if you haven't yet. I'll put more information in the description below, as I always do, so go check that out. From a beautiful, Beautiful <laughs> Rhino Rich Karma Rhino Trust Sanctuary. I'm Nick from Namibia and you'll be watching 54 Day Africa. Road ahead is quite unclear. Let me walk in despite fear. The road stretches over the hills. And I've got many debts to pay. Somewhere on